I think, I think we've scored four out of eight before. Oh, now it's today. into the air. It's Kirstens who gets the shot away. Right footed, slots it past Batters Bay. No, Kirsten Town doesn't look to be a lot of talking going on. Oh, I, I thought that was no one really controlling it. Tongue. Uh, oh, it's into. Uh, the shot comes in. It's yeah! to be It was a great cross across the area by Michael Lafayette. And it gets away from Brown. It's still Dixon into Brandy. Brandy. Back to Meekly, cross comes in from Meekly, it's a good one, it's at the back post and it's met at the back post by Kersens. And then 69 minutes, he doubles the lead. Olabi to take this penalty from the open terrace, Easton.com terrace. Right footed penalty. penalty. Here he comes and he scores. Sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. Confidently dispatched. Now, Olabi versus Lawson. Up comes Olabi and saved, but the follow up is popped in by Olabi. Ball to Olabi into the box, back to goal. We can use. Pemberton does Pemberton though no, he has he's forced back gets it nothing from that side felt here he squares it to Dawson Dawson might get it onto his right foot does shoots blocked comes out to the right hand side to Pemberton Pemberton's prop header in there and it's a fabulous header for Dundee Walabi that's his hat trick and that beautiful header in off the left hand
So Radcliffe will be kicking left to right. Ashton, they'll be kicking right to left as the ball is set back to an Ashton body. He's cleared up field. It's cleared away, though, by Maynard. Dudley gets underneath it. It's headed away, though, once again. It's in the breaks in the middle of the park for James Hardy. And now it's Luke Burke all the way back to Newton, all the way back to Cooper, who slips as he clears it. Headed away by Fawnley relatively comfortably to the feet of Brad Jackson, who's descending down this right-hand side, looking to work his way towards the byline. Delivers the ball in. It's a good ball in. It's met by Radcliffe, and it's in. It's Jordan Yu with his 22nd goal of the campaign. Certainly is, isn't he? Thankfully, when the ball went low and stayed on the floor. But then it does find low, and now we're... Cowan on this right-hand side. He's got low operating himself on the overlap, but it'll fall to the back post for Warren Clark, who's making his way into the penalty area now. He's up against Jackson. Breaks to Hardy. Hardy threads it forward for Adams. It's back to Hardy. And then low strikes in it. So, it took a touch. The final, the final it's touch back. is off. Adams brought Maynard's underneath it. And then back to Hewell. Hewell to Adams. Adams across for Maynard. Maynard out to the left-hand side for Jamie Morgan. And then Oh, Maynard once again, but it's a loose touch which breaks to James Hardy who slides it across the field and it's 2-1 and Ashton lead now after 35 minutes and again through Warren Clark. Warren Clark bypasses Brad Jackson but he loses out to Dudley but the ball does deflect through to Hardy. Warren Clark once again looking to deliver it across the floor but a touch at the near post forces him further out wide. And it's a good touch in fairness by Gilchrist. Back to Warren Clark in the penalty area. Back to Nathan Lowe. It's in. It's great, great, great goal in fairness by Nathan Lowe. And has, of course, netted on 16 occasions this season for Raglan. And it's in the back of the net. And there is daylight at the end of the tunnel. And Josh Hancock. And that illustrious equalising goal as the ball almost breaks for Hancock. Good. And then it's sent forward for Gilchrist, the man who is the top goal scorer for Ashton. The, the ball sent forward to Hardy. The offside flag's not going to go off. He's by Pass you out and it's in the back of the net. And it is a fourth goal, and you suspect that that will be game over for Ashton. Has gone. Will Alburn grab his second goal of the game? He will. He sends you out the wrong way, and the Robins extend their lead from 4 to 5. And you can't say Anton. 